So hello to everyone. Uh, haven't been here for a little time, but still here and still doing my new video. Uh, let's talk uh, today about this guy. I have finally purchased a diagnostic uh, solution for my cars, for my Mercedes and for my uh, Volkswagen. So, as you can see, uh, this is Auto uh, OBD2 and OBD1 scanner. Here you can see the part number Maxi Diagnostics EU7002. Uh, uh, this is a diagnostic system for European uh, vehicles. Uh, here you can see uh, all the marks and uh, manufacturers it diagnoses. Uh, here are uh, and uh, this and uh, this is important for me today uh, it is not uh, new uh, but it is not <laughs> used at all it is used one or two times it came to me from uh, United Kingdom from England uh, I have already unboxed it uh, and uh, want to uh, say you that uh, uh, the diagnostic apparat itself is in very good condition. Here you can see the vehicle coverage. It does. Uh, uh, this is a WAG, Volvo, BMW, BMW Mini, Opel, uh, Mercedes, and uh, other European uh, cars. Um, it may uh, read uh, some uh, non-European cars, but I don't know. I at once uh, I uh, am uh, repeating that I bought it for for my German cars now I will uh, unbox it and show you what is inside so guys here is a very nice punch bag of it. We are uh, the main uh, diagnostic uh, is located, uh, and you can carry it very easy with you. So uh, now I will uh, open it and show you how it looks. So here we are. Uh, it uh, came to me with a, a user manual uh, with uh, the cable you can upgrade the uh, system of it inside so uh, also um, here we can see the uh, compact disc max disc software update 2 which is on the disc itself uh, the regular obd2 <coughs> cable uh, this goes to uh, in the apparat itself and uh, this goes to on your cars obd2 port if it has it uh, i want to say that my uh, mk4 gti has obd2 port i have um, yesterday test it and it uh, covers all the systems is set here as uh, this diagnostic uh, uh, solution is uh, for engine automatic transmission ABS and airbags uh, it uh, diagnoses all these four systems on European cars and it does not need any adapter if your car has a regular 60 pin OBD port for uh, my Mercedes, I want to say that the car is German spec and it has no OBD port. It has a regular uh, Mercedes uh, 38 uh, pin port under the hood. And now I have to uh, got some adapters, but not the cheap $5 adapters, which can only 
uh, work with the global uh, engine uh, uh, error codes i want to buy some um, uh, quality adapter which uh, at least costs about 30 euros on ebay day i already have found it which is uh, suitable for this model and uh, when it will arrive uh, to me i will show you how it works on my mercedes so now let's put it aside this is a cable and uh, unbox and talk about uh, the main diagnostic apparat here it is this is uh, not used as i said already this is in very good condition as you can see now uh, It still has this uh, plastic cover on it, you can see. Uh, and now, guys, uh, I will show you detail this apparatus. Uh, this is uh, not uh, very heavy, but uh, uh, this is, you feel it, this is quality uh, diagnostic uh, solution. Uh, about five or four years, I am searching the right diagnostic uh, tool for my car, and at least I have found it and i bought it uh, for the third price of this solution uh, i bought it under uh, 75 dollars and uh, if you uh, can find it new it will be cost more than uh, 150 dollars here you can see uh, that it is from a uh, uh, uk uh, united kingdom this has four batteries here i already have put energizer batteries uh, here and now I will uh, turn it on and show you the coverage of the vehicles it has so guys uh, Let's turn it on here you can see and uh, now uh, uh, Here is the menu itself and we can see what it has uh, Benz, BMW, Opel, Volvo, WAG, uh, reviewing data, system setup and tool information. Uh, reviewing data is uh, for saved data about uh, error codes. System setup is the setup of the main tool. Tool information tells us what is the software which is uh, inside of the tool so now we want to see what vehicles does it cover uh, for mercedes now i will show you here we are uh, here are the models e a class b class c class e class s class uh, sl class m class and r class uh, this model model covers the uh chassis so for me of course and uh, now it is important that it uh cover uh, it cover it will cover e-class chassis uh, now i will show you when we go to the e-class uh these have two models uh w211 and w210 uh we have uh, i have w210 let's go here there and uh it shows S of uh, uh, zero, zero 0397DAS3. Uh, uh, I don't know what is mean, but let's uh, go to this menu. Okay, and now we can choose uh, the model. Here is the sedan T model or long chassis. Uh, I uh, am interested in sedans now. Uh, of course gasoline and here we are it uh, starts from e 200 e 230 e 200 compressor e 240 uh, of course you can see the chassis numbers uh, e 280 e 320 and E430, E55 AMG, and at least it has E280 uh, formatic, E320 uh, formatic, and E430 formatic. 
So now I am sure that this model covers my car. Here it is E430 210 uh, 210 uh, uh, 070. This is E430. And when I uh, <laughs> press it, here you can see what it says. Uh, this is not connected to a vehicle and uh, because as I try it says uh, this message uh, <coughs> yesterday I uh, as already said tested it on my uh, um, VW um, MK4 GTA and it uh, covered all the systems uh, it is uh, right down here and uh, my uh, GTI has only one error code um, it says mixture regulation uh, so uh, ABS um, and airbags were uh, error free uh, so guys once again uh, this is a great tool for European cars uh, I will use it use it hardly on my cars and uh, show you uh, how it will work uh, I am sure now that I have invested right way on this tool and it will uh, save me uh, a lot of time to uh, see what's wrong with my car also it has live data uh, you can see uh, every uh, live options of your car when it is uh, turned on uh, engine uh, airflow uh, temperature uh, and other uh, options so very good tool and uh, recommend to everyone who wants uh, a good uh, not cheap but good uh, diagnostic for uh, the Mercedes it is not a, as good as a star diagnosis, but star diagnosis costs uh, 500 euros and for the garage it is not uh, very uh, reasonable to spend 500 euros for diagnostic apparat. So guys, as, already, as I already said, now I am waiting for the... Uh, adapter for my car and then I show you how uh, this uh, guy will work and perform with my car so this is a small video stay tuned please subscribe thank you for watching and bye bye